And with that, we bring in Kevin Riggs for the Riggs Report. Yeah, what are we expecting to hear from Sessions today? Well, uh, this is going to be a whole new level of conflict, frankly, between California and the Trump administration. So um, really kind of a volatile, very explosive situation. Uh, Jeff Sessions, as you mentioned, has uh, filed this lawsuit uh, against the state of California and Governor Brown over a handful of California laws dealing with so-called sanctuary city policies. Certainly, immigration is a powder keg issue in California, and I think Sessions has lit the fuse with that lawsuit that he filed yesterday. He will be addressing questions about the lawsuit, as we've been talking about a little bit later this morning at the Kempton Hotel in front of the California Peace Officers Association. And uh, frankly, he'll be, he'll be answering a lot of questions about public safety, but uh, this is a huge, again, area of conflict, political conflict, unlike that that we've seen in the past. Uh, a lot of questions to be asked, a lot of questions to be answered about these new policies. So what would you say is the, the most significant or telling political reaction so far? Well, uh, I talked in my blog last week about um, the Trump administration poking the California bear, and that's essentially what's going on here. And so uh, Governor Brown yesterday was very quick to offer his response in a statement yesterday, calling uh, the lawsuit by Jeff Sessions a um, political D.C. style stunt. He also said that uh, Sessions was in California to polarize and divide America. Uh, as far as uh, Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg, who is an outspoken supporter of sanctuary city policies, he's in D.C. this week for meetings, but he issued a statement saying that uh, California would continue to support and provide help for its uh, diverse immigrant populations. So a lot of... Um, questions here that law enforcement folks have about what their role should be. They're not going to get any clarification, though, anytime soon, because you can bet this lawsuit's going to end up in the U.S. Supreme Court. It's going to take months and months. Mm -hmm. And this is just kind of the warm-up for President Trump. He is going to make his first visit to California since becoming president. Any details on, on what we can expect from this visit? Well, we don't have any specific dates at this point, but reporters have been told that the president and his entourage will be in San Diego around the middle of this month, so in the next couple of weeks. He will be touring several prototypes of the wall that he wants Congress to authorize construction of along the uh, Mexican border. Now, a section of that wall is already under construction in Calexico, uh, east of San Diego. But certainly, as you say, this will be his first uh, trip to California as the president. President, he'll be answering a lot of questions about the wall. He'll be answering a lot of questions about his recent threats to pull ICE agents from California. And also, obviously, he'll have questions to answer about this new lawsuit filed by his attorney general this week dealing with sanctuary city policies. So Kevin does write a political blog, which he just mentioned a moment ago, and tomorrow's Riggs report will post at midnight. I don't know what on earth you'll possibly find to talk about this week. <laughs> it's going to be tough. There you, go. you can read it on our KCRA News app. Kevin, thanks. Yep.